do so many things. Like one thing she made us do the first or second lesson was stand up and put a brush in your hand and this hand, put it in the water and then just put marks all over the piece of paper. Would you believe that someone bought my painting? <laughs> that painting, it was hideous. I thought it was hideous, but they didn't. They loved it. It was an abstract. Maybe I should have stayed with abstracts, okay? <laughs> But anyway, I met a friend there, and her name was, are you ready for this? Calliope Polemus, a little Greek lady, Calliope. She's still around, and she's still haunting me. She lives in a, a assisted living in um, the palace in Miami, and I'm going to go see her at the end of the month. She's going to be 80-something, almost 90. But we talked so much in class. Can you believe that? Yes. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> we talked so much in class that... The teacher had to separate us, and we almost got kicked out of class, but it doesn't matter. So, I'm still painting because um, my friend in high school, Brian Trench, he's gone now, bless his soul, uh, he said, Lolly, if you didn't talk so much, you'd be a really good artist. So, I broke his arm. <laughs> <laughs> that was okay. Don't you think that warranted that? Yeah. I think so, too. <laughs> no. Geneva, here you are, sweetheart. You've got to put this on there. Thanks. Look, okay, sweetheart. Look. Look. Scrunch it down. Look. Cool, huh? Yes. Okay, cool. Scrunch it any way you want it. Okay? I want to put this. Which side am I going to put it? It in? doesn't matter if the, wa if the water's over the middle anyway. Here you are. You can scrunch it around there any way you want, all right? See? Yeah. You're going to go across like that with the water, all right? Oh, okay. I'm going okay. up and down. Well, it doesn't matter. It oh. doesn't matter because the water doesn't know what direction it's going in. So, okay? And if you feel better making it go up and down, that's perfectly all right because okay. I love you anyway. Okay? okay? So there you are, sweetheart. <laughs> okay? There's Fine no question. wrong or right way to do this. What are you doing, kid? Are you having a good time? <coughs> yes. Okay. Add some water to that. Watch your sleeve. And put some more. Oh, you got so, you got a lot of water on there. That's good. Okay, sweetheart, you're doing fine. You're doing fine. Listen, Catherine, I'm going to ask you to put this over there on your right side, sweetheart, because I don't want to say it's mine when it's not, even though it's nicer than mine. Okay. Now here's your here's your, now let's take your paper. This oh, you know what, Evelyn? Maybe we need to have another piece of paper now. <clears throat> What you're going to do here is, Evelyn, if you will, first of all, everybody gets, we need, might need some glue too, Evelyn. What kind see. of glue would you like? Well, I don't know, one that sticks. Uh, everybody <laughs> gets to pick a, um, everybody gets to pick a heart to go on their card. Do you want be kind? Pick one that you want, sweetheart. Which one do you want? That one? Okay, that's going to go on your card. Leave it turned over because it has a little sticky. Okay, I'm going to give you this heart. I'm going to give you that heart. And I'm going to give you that heart. Okay, I'm going to give you three hearts. And you're going to trace them on your card. Two. Look, you can, I'm going to give you this one with a face. Okay. How cute. I have three size hearts, okay? Yes, I do. Okay, you have three size hearts. Mm -hmm. Okay, now what you're going to do is take the front of your card and you're going to paint like I showed you on the other piece of paper, but you're going to do it lighter. I want you to do it lighter, okay? Why do I want you to do it lighter? <clears throat> because you're going to paint. First of all, let's put a heart on here. One of the hearts that I gave you, you can take them and you can trace them on your card, okay? So you take one here, put one there, and take a little itty bitty one, a little itty bitty one like this, and place them on your card any way you want, anywhere you want. You're gonna trace them, okay? You like that one? I think this is the same. Okay. Okay, and while you're doing this, think about who you would send this to. And you can always send it to me. I'll give you my address, okay? When in doubt, you can send it to me, okay? One, two. Now, you notice I gave you three. Why did I give you three? Balance. <clears throat> well, Catherine says it's because of balance. 
usually it's because an uneven number is more aesthetic, aesthetic to the eye, okay? Now, you can place it in a triangle. You get it now. Here's a secret. Don't tell anybody. Watercolor dries 20 to 25% lighter. Oh yeah, see how dark they are? But they're going to come out lighter after they dry. Okay, so see how light I'm doing this? See how light I'm doing my card? Versus what I did on the... Now, if you want to again, you tell me and I'll give you... Some... I'll give you saran wrap, and you can use saran wrap on this if you like. Although, I don't know if it's going to work as well. The paper isn't the same. Okay, so now, see how light this is? <laughs> okay, look. Look how much lighter it dried. Oh, my God. <laughs> see? See how much lighter it dried already? Okay, so I painted my background and my heart. Going a little heavy there, Geneva. I guess I did. Okay, that's all right, sweetheart. It's your painting. Look, Geneva, look. See how light that is? And see how much lighter it came out when it was dry? Valentine's Day across the front and put love Regina or love Catherine or I, I'm sending my loves. Here's the other thing. You can draw, you can draw little lines coming down from the heart that look like little balloons that are flying. Okay? That's just a creative side that I have. I thought of that while I was sitting here because I was hungry. Okay? <laughs> you expect food to come floating? Through? Yes, yes, okay. I do. Yes. May I have like, so 80 20. So I look at it this way 80% pasta, 20% salad. It's extension in life at our age that we are. I think um, Russell and I talked about are you ready for this? Guess what I saw? Guess what I saw on uh, Facebook the other day? There was this nun. Guess how old she is. And oh. she just died. Guess how old she is. 118 years old. Oh, my God. <laughs> Do you know what I would be doing at 118? I would be sleeping in my rocker. What can you do at 118? But my great-great-grandmother lived to be 104. And guess what? She had 10 kids, so guess what she liked to do? Uh, <laughs> no, she lived to be 104. She had 10 children, two sets of twins, of which one set died. She came to my grandmother's funeral when my grandmother died at 83. She flew from California to Philadelphia at 103. Oh my God. So, whatever you, what, no matter how long you live, keep going, keep doing. Keep putting one foot in front of the other. Love each other. Love yourself. Beautiful Valentine's cards. Very nice.